Many real estate investors visit our website seeking private financing for a multifamily deal, but in many cases, it turns out that the subject property is not technically multifamily. In this short video, I'll clarify the meaning of multifamily and provide the proper terminology you should use to describe a multi-unit property when you're requesting a loan from private lending companies, also known as bridge lenders or hard money lenders. I'm Rocky Batani, founder of PrivateLenderLink.com, where investors and brokers can easily find direct private lending companies. If you are in the investment real estate business and want to gain insights into private mortgage lending, subscribe to our channel and get notified every time we release a new video. In commercial real estate finance, the meaning of the term multifamily is defined very simply. It's a property with five or more dwelling units. If a property has less than five units, it's classified as residential property. More than five units is classified as commercial. So when you're seeking a bridge loan, a rehab loan, or a long-term rental loan for a property with less than five dwelling units, don't call it multifamily. The term you use depends on the number of units. A property with two dwelling units can be called duplex, or a two-unit residential property. Three dwelling units is a triplex, or a three-unit residential property. And four units is a fourplex, quadplex, or a four-unit residential property. If the property has three dwelling units and one retail unit, it's considered a mixed-use property. The classification of residential versus multifamily is mainly relevant for the long-term loan which refinances a short-term bridge loan or rehab loan provided by a private mortgage lender. While there are lots of conventional lenders that can take out a short-term private loan on a dwelling property, the majority of them only consider residential investment properties with four units or less. The majority of private lenders that would offer a short-term loan on a four-unit residential property would also consider a 10-unit multifamily property. For a short-term loan less than two years, multifamily properties are almost always considered by private lenders. Starting in 2018, many private lending companies started offering 30-year rental loans at interest rates similar to conventional loans, but only for properties with up to four units. Some private lenders can go up to eight units for a long-term loan, which they'd call a multifamily property. If you're seeking a private mortgage for a multifamily or residential investment property, use our website privatelenderlink.com as a resource to find direct private lending companies nationwide. You can browse lender profiles and then reach out to them directly, or create a loan request to provide information about your financing needs. If you'd like our assistance, we can review your loan request and invite a few select lenders to view it. Any lenders interested in funding your loan will reach out to you and you'd work with them directly. Our platform is available to real estate investors and mortgage brokers. If you found the content in this video to be useful, please click the like button and be sure to check out our other videos about private mortgage lending. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.